Hey gang, how are we all? Welcome back to the channel. Do bear with me on the lighting. I'm in the queue park. The lightness and grace were literally in the pitch black right now. However, I've come to town because I believe Primark Home has all of their new collection in. So I think it's given like sort of Ibiza vibes, coastal vibes, a few new scents and smells. I actually went to Trafford Centre yesterday. Oh my god, no use. I thought my camera broke. If you follow me on Instagram, the lens wouldn't open. No, that keeps happening. I think it's a camera issue. Um, so I didn't even film much in the traffic centre. That's that's another story. We won't even go there. Um, I wanted to do a YouTube video there, but I did pop into the Primark and traffic centre. It was woeful, woeful. Um, but I know the VM girl who works here. She's so lovely, and she was like, "L, all the stuffs in this morning." So I literally rushed up to get ready. I literally just threw something on, and I cannot wait to go and see what Primark Home I've got to offer. They literally slay it. Like they're just on the ball. They also had DW Home, so they have candle dupes as well. So I hope they've got them in this store, um, because that will be good to show you. So yeah, um, I've got a bit of a walk, and I don't know whether to wear the sunglasses. She's given like Pinterest girlies today. She really is. But anyway, let's go to Primark. Oh my God, use it's so good already. Look at these tea towels. No, they are gorgeous. Two pound fifty. No, obsessed. I feel like this will be a, like a collection inside. We haven't even made it inside yet, by the way. I think this might be a picnic throw. It's like um, hessian material. I absolutely love it. And as I say, only just walked in. We've got a soda pop dupe candle. It's in citrus days. I haven't smelled it yet. I'll smell it if they've got it inside. But it's four pound fifty, so it is a little bit cheaper. I think the ones from DW might be six ninety nine, so they are a little bit cheaper. Oh my god, juice! How unreal is this? I don't know what theme it is, but oh my god, what like mini cactuses! It's given. It's given. I be there. They are six pounds. No, I'm obsessed with this. It's like concrete and wicker. What a mixed material item! I think it's eight quid. Yeah, it is. How gorgeous is that? All ornaments as well. And they've got another um, DW dupe in the rhubarb and rose. Both of these scents I don't think I've seen yesterday. So they've literally got so many of the dupes. This must be 450 as well. I want to smell them, but it's literally chocolate out here. So I'll... Oh my God, that's a strawberry. Oh my God. Oh, they've got a pure strawberry theme going on. Got these cushions for £8. And does this not remind you of the Sophia and Chintia strawberry vase? I think it's like seven pounds. Sorry, I'm balancing my phone as well because I'm trying to get TikToks. I think that says seven pounds. Isn't that unbelievable? If you didn't like red, you could always spray a pink, but I know, you know, red is strawberry kind of thing. How unbelievable is this? It has got a name, the theme. I don't know what it is, but it's, it is given Mexican, it's given Texas Hold'em, Beyonce, all that. This is given real Oliver Bonus. Now I always, I know I always say like, oh, this is given, but like Primark do really good, affordable, inspired pieces. There's a pineapple here as well, £2.50. And then they're here as well again. I absolutely love them. And I love these cushion covers as well. How gorgeous are they? No, I'm obsessed. How much are they? Seven pounds. They're gorgeous. You can get gorgeous like inserts from like I think two nil. Two nice inserts. And I just love how all this is styled. These are fab as well. Two pound fifty. Aren't they unbelievable? Oh my god. They're fab. They're like the Bawab dupes. How unreal are they? Oh stop it. The watermelon theme is really watermelon ink right now. Oh they're fab, aren't they? What do they remind me of? Aren't they fab? My mate um, got actually, no, they're defo. No, that smells unbelievable. Oh my God, no, I need that. Okay, can confirm, Botanical Garden smells delicious, but they've also got Amber and Bergamont. Let me smell that. That smells nice, but it's not as strong as that. They are absolutely gorgeous. Six pound. Oh my god, you've found it. So this is called Santel 62. When I say this is actually such a good dupe of the Lilaba, I can't even say that. Candle. I mean fragrances, it really is. It's absolutely beautiful. It's four pound fifty. Isn't that gorgeous? Right, I found the candles. I wanna smell them. Okay, that absolutely it smells nice, but that smells the rhubarb and rose smells like pink gin lemonade night out after a few. Then there's this one which is just citrus days. 
I'm not dinner with that smells like. That smells like alcohol again. I'm not the biggest fan. You. That one's nice. That's probably the best one. So that is the lemon chili spritz in tree. That one before, but that does come with a lid. But I think this is the last one. Yeah, that's the nicest one. I'm still not wild, but them too. They do smell like alcoholic beverages. But if you like that pink gin, then this probably can go for you. This one's a bit too citrusy for me, but I prefer more like plain, like, oh, just there, splash the candle. I prefer more like vanilla plain candles, if that makes sense. So yeah, that's that one. I also love this tray. That'd be really nice, like styled there with some of these bits, you know, you know, we've got something like this. Obviously, I'm just whipping something together here. But how nice is that? I don't know whether you could put that on the wall as well, maybe as like an actual mirror. But it's really, really nice. Oh, they've got a tray here. Isn't that nice? That is gorgeous. Water and can I mean, I don't like stuff like this. I think this is a little bit tatty, I'm not going to lie. Um, I love this tablecloth. That is gorgeous. Oh my God, you've found it. No, this is the last one left. So it is a milk cart and it's literally a fiver. This is going to go viral, like it's one of them pieces where it's like everyone's going to literally want their hands on them and I'm not surprised how quirky is that? No, I really want it, I actually don't need it, it's not going to match with anything but it is so cool, if you've got like a proper quirky space please come and get this because it's absolutely sensational I also love these as well, the bubble effect on that is absolutely stunning, it's like um, H&M -y. I've also spotted these trinket dishes as well. They're such a good price point, four pound. Have your jewelry on them, things like that. I've actually got that in black and white. Um, I love these baskets as well. They're nice with the little palms on. And then I like these as well. They're gorgeous. They're just a staple in the home as well. They're giving very Ralph Lauren, aren't they? There's some um, Ralph Lauren lamps through which have the base like that, which I love. I kind of want this, you know. It literally won't go with anything. I'm going to hide it, <laughs> just in case I want it. <laughs> How gorgeous is that? I wish that was the right size for my bed because I would have bought that. I think I did that in the very first, you know, when Primal Home like opened. I think I did that. Oh, they've got all the bunny um, rings. I know we're past Easter, but they should be on sale, I reckon. Oh, wow, look at the muggies. <gasps> wow, that is gorgeous. That's like a tile, isn't it? They also had them in H&M, literally identical, so they're a fantastic dupe. And they've got the shell one as well. How gorgeous is that? And what is that? Be happy. That's quite cute. Not the biggest fan of that, but it's nice. Any round here. Um, they're very good um, ones of the Molly May ones. <gasps> oh, wow. Oh, stop it. They're like the Firm Liver ones. Oh, used £2.50. The Firm Liver ones are very expensive. They're the best ones I've seen. I've not seen them before, I don't think. They're gorgeous as well, aren't they? They just scream holiday. Oh, uh, what my goodness, the twisty straws are back. Oh my god, they've got shell ones. No, I screamed, I put these on TikTok last year and they went viral and they sold out. Hilarious. I also really like them, but no. I really want them twirly straws. I might have to buy them, you know. I think I'm going to have to. I really like the sheer designs, though, aren't they nice? Oh my god, Jews, they've got all the fruit plates and bowls. I actually don't even know what these are. Like, what is that? Is that a pomegranate? Like inside? Or is that a pomegranate? So these are the bowls, so I didn't tell you how much the plates were. These are five pounds, so these were on this morning a few weeks ago. I don't know whether anyone watched it. They were doing like table setups for like spring, summer. And oh my god, this is... Is that a papaya? <laughs> I'm terrible. I eat fruits as well. I don't even know what they are. Um, they're the five. The bowl actually doesn't have a price, but this is the last one. Looks more like a dragon fruit. It's got like all hand-painted bits on the side. And then they've also got the watermelon plate as well which is gorge they're five pound um and then i love these as well these are great like little coasters they look easily wipeable as well um you know for like outside and things like that and then they've got pineapple napkins which are gorgeous and there's another candlestick holder but this one's a lemon which i love oh and i love these how beautiful are them plates <gasps> I love all the shells that are coming like back in this season. They're 350 use that is such I love the scalloped edging as well. How gorgeous. And the matching tea towels. They've got a jug. And I love mixing as well. I just put that back. I love mixing the woods with um like the mango woods. 
with the blue. I think that looks gorgeous together. The uh, remind me of the Anna and Nina candles, £2.50 with the lavender. Stunning. Sorry, just returning back to the candles because it went a bit quiet while it was busy before. How fab are they? Sunset Breeze shell candles. Smells well for decent as well. And then they've got the DW dupe soda pop things that I've just smelt in a room spray. Isn't that nice? I mean, as I say, it's not my favourite, but if you do like holiday scents, then it's perfect for you. Who use? You know, this that I got literally last year that I have beside my bed. It's boss. The Fame Living one's about 50 quid. This is only a tenner. Would recommend getting. And they've also got the bowl and plate collection back. Oh, I love them. Oh, they've got the shell on. I've seen them before. They're like the wavy bowls. How gorgeous are they? I've seen a girl do like a little dessert on TikTok and them like with lemon sorbet in. And I don't know what it is, but if you have nice bowls and nice plates, it makes your food taste better, I swear. Is anyone else onto that? I'm loving this as well. All the colours in. It's given very summer. This has been a really popular tufted cushion as well which i'm surprised only a tenner got a lot of throws they got them candles in normal as well if you don't like the soda pop design they've got them in like glass love this as well it's very in this year gorgeous i applaud anybody that can sleep in literally a duvet that's like a dressing gown i would literally be sick i'd be that hot like like I love having like about seven blankets on me but not that material like, i'd genuinely be sick oh i am obsessed with these Aren't they gorgeous? Very on trend right now. The bath towel is £8 and the hand is 5 Stop. And then I love this setup as well. This is all the new bathroom bit. This is actually something they sell, but isn't that such a nice idea? You know, if you've got a guest room, it's like put like a few little bits in for your guests. I know, it's very bougie, but like that's, that's the aspiration I have. I love this little shell bowl as well. Be gorgeous for like trinkets and things like that. I like the coral, but I do think it reminds me of like lockdown. Do you know what I mean? Like that's when I bought it, which is four pound fifty, which is gorgeous. But yeah, it just reminds me of lockdown a little bit. Oh, how gorgeous are they? Yes, little daisy baskets, and they've also got fabric ones, but they come on a little thing like this, and they're only a fiver. These are like the hay baskets. They've also got the scalloped baskets back as well. And this is really nice. I don't think I've seen that before. Love the little mixed material. I've just run into TK Maxx because I actually couldn't help myself. How unreal is all like the coral stuff? I actually love that. I know I've just said in Primark that I didn't really like the coral stuff. But look at all like these little shell ornaments. How gorgeous, by the way. Got some bits from Primark I'll show you when I get back to the car. Um, I literally queued, by the way, for almost an hour just to get what I wanted. Honestly, it's a joke. And vessel that I've got in my studio, bought a smaller version. I've actually got the one that I had in my studio in the Aintree Home Centre as we speak. So if you did want it, oh my god, isn't that gorgeous? There's just something about TK Maxx, like the thrill of the find, isn't there? I love that. How funny is that? Is that like a little biscuit jar? So at the back as well. How funny are they? I love these as well. Loads of show homes you will spot have them. I've seen them online, I'll link them for you. How has no one bought this? And it's in the clearance as well. I don't know. Oh gosh, <laughs> I don't know how much that is, but if I had my own house, that would be coming home with me. How gorgeous are they? Oh, stop it. They are beautiful. <gasps> no, they are gorgeous. And as well, they've got the multicolor balloon dog and this jar, which I've never ever seen before, and I absolutely love it. They've got the DW collection as well. Popped up there. It's got like a fuzzy top. These as well, which are like coconut rice pudding. <gasps> now I need to smell that. I'm even going to put off. It's like. Plastic lid like that, it's like honey. Lou use that smells amazing. Oh wow, that's like vanilla, rice milk, vanilla, and cinnamon sugar. Oh, that's gorgeous. That's my ideal candle. I actually want to smell what the DW new ones smell like. Mm, I'm not a fan. Oh. oh no, 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 no. I literally posted these yesterday, and no one battered my lid on my Instagram story and they are stunning, they're like baobab candles with this like little feature at the top, no sorry it's an ornament as well, how gorgeous. There's also the DW um, Sherbet Creamery candles, they just look like ice creams, they're amazing. These are literally like diptyque dupes, they are gorgeous. I feel like we should just call these videos Ellie doing candle centre. Is blueberry lemonade. Absolutely not. No. Cucumber mint mojito. 
By the way, there is a hole that's off and I just like trying to smoke through there. It just feels like you can buy it. I don't mind. I'm bad for it. I don't think I'd want that. Like, fuck me out. You know what I mean? It's how unreal this is. Look at the detail in that. I never want to burn that. It's only 14 99 as well. I feel like so much work's gone into that for that. No, you know how much I'm obsessed with lemons. Sorry, this jar is incredible. It's Ellen for the lemons like series <laughs> collection even out and they don't have this. So if you get in the H&M home lemon pieces, there's four here. Run. I'm just gonna apologize now for the lighting. <laughs> but I just want to show you what I got. Not an extravagant, but I just got literally two things. I waited for a good 20 minutes by the way to get these two things. Um I've got some straws because i've been using glass straws right and and it sounds mad they've been breaking and like chipping and i'm thinking imagine like i did that on my tooth or something like that so it'd be sending me a little bit a little bit anxiety so i already had a few plastic ones like from starbucks cups that i had but i just wanted new ones and also some summery ones and also i posted these last year and they sold out and they work out like 50p a straw which i think is so good they're probably going to be an absolute nightmare to like clean the twizzly bit but yeah they went viral i didn't get them and then when i tried to go back and get them i just couldn't and also this sounds really vain but like not vain but like obviously when i post instagram pictures of like me summer smoothies that i do i don't want them to look ugly and i feel like that twilly straw will just be so cute and glasses we have just normal glasses from ikea which i think everyone has but i've always wanted the firm living glasses and we have literally no more room for glasses like i'm gonna go home and i'm gonna go wife bought another glass i'm gonna be like i know i'm sorry but i've literally just bought selfishly just one for me so that when i do my smoothie videos and pictures it sounds awful but it was only two pound fifty and the straws were two pounds so i got four pound fifty the firm living ones are so expensive like even for like a four they're just so pricey so yeah anyway that was like world's smallest primark home haul but the stuff in there is gorgeous like i said this on instagram last night like i'm having a little bit of a moment news where like obviously i'm a home interior account and i do have my own house and if i was in a position to buy one i wouldn't even still want to buy one like it's not the fact but sometimes when i'm creating content and like when i want to buy stuff i'm like well what's the point like i do it on my own house and sometimes i'm like Ugh. it does get me down it does get me annoyed but like it's just one of them things so like when I see all these gorgeous stuff and I say to you, oh my god, that's unreal, like, I couldn't possibly have another candle in the house because it's literally, I need a storage unit for said candles. I couldn't have another vase. I genuinely would genuinely get kicked out with all the vases and I would be the woman, not the woman that lived in a shoe, the woman that lived in a vase, literally. So, it's just getting to a point now where it's just, like, frustrating, but, like, you know, I trust in the time and of my own life and things like that. That's very deep. It's, I think, oh, Ellie, you're only doing a Primark home. What's new in? And you doing a deep chat at the end. Is there any need? But anyway, um, I do hope you enjoyed this video. I'm actually on my way to Home Sense now to do another video. So there's going to be a new and Home Sense video coming. Um, it is half term, which was a little bit of a nightmare shopping, like like probably like bombastic side eye like i know it sounds like a proper match but like i just hate half term i just can't get any filament done because there's kids running around so i don't want to get them in the shot and it's just an absolute nightmare i know first world props i know um but yeah there's going to be a home sense video coming or i might have no i think the home sense video will be coming or i might have posted it i don't know which way around it'll be but anyway um do make sure you do give this a like if you enjoyed it because that just helps me to know what content you like and also i would really really appreciate it if you could follow me if you do love my content you can follow me on here and also on instagram and tiktok at feminine interiors so yeah thank you so so much for watching i'm so sorry about the lighting i do hope you enjoyed this video and i will definitely catch you on my next one